Western is such a, you know, a lovely place, and then all these beautiful sceneries and all those beautiful buildings, you know, you, you can never see it anywhere else other than Bellingham, probably. <laughs> and the faculties are great and then they're helpful and just Bellingham is great. I think um, Western students are pretty friendly and the teacher seems um, really care about students and uh, the class size is not that big. It's um, normally 20 to 30 students. I think it's not only hard for me, it's hard for everybody. You used to speak one language and you have to come to a new place to speak other language. Even though we, I studied the English at, since my high school, but I still feel like the, that's a really different situation like between university and uh, high schools. There's a bit of difference like um, before when I don't use English as much as now. I won't see like how my English got improved, but now like I use it every day and some of my friends in China, back in China, they will say like, well, your English is really good. So I can see like the advantages of like really get to know another language besides your native language. Yes, I think Western really changed me as a person. For the most part, I think I grew more mature after coming here for college. I wasn't ready the first year. So it comes back to me sometimes that I didn't really try hard the first year, so I get I wasn't getting good grades. I think after that I realized that there's more important things in my life that I need to do, so um, I choose to study harder. So Western does that really help for me. If you want to learn a lot, Western can really help me and shape you into a, a sort of a, more of a study material. <laughs> but it taught me how to be mature, and it taught me a lot of a lot of things that I haven't encountered when I was in China. In, in the U.S., the most sort of the most advanced theory and knowledge always came from the universities. So I get this chance to um, sort of meet up with the most advanced things that you know ever happened in human history. So um, I'm really grateful. The university life isn't as easy as like I thought before. In China we have a misconception about like university life because like it's pretty easy to get a degree in China because uh, like our, our high school is really tough so the college life is pretty smooth compared to high school life but um, here in America it's really independent like you really have to learn by yourself. I thought it's like so really nice to have a friend here but also, I think the best things here is I had some native speak friend, like the American friends. They like to hang out with me. They don't care what like the language I speak, how terrible I speak to them. They just help me and willing to be a friend with me. Probably one of the important things is just for international students I have really communicate with your professor and all your classmates because like it doesn't matter how long you're here for there is still a language barrier that sometimes you will find in difficult classes. I would say first prepare your language that's the most important part um, after all this is the US and it's a completely different language compared to China so you gotta have at least some of the language skill. I mean, I know that intensive English programming here is really, really good, and it will prepare you for the upcoming college, uh, university classes, courses. But it's also important that you first have a sort of a base of the language, so you can have something to start with. Bring an umbrella or a ring jacket. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of rain. And second of all, I think you, you have to become prepared because the U.S. is completely different from China. The culture, how to make friends, how to eat, even eat, you know. Also here, I made my best friends and she's like the American, she's good with me. And I think it's like you have to uh, join your new lives and university, it's a good place to start with that.
Even though sometimes you feel like the hard to go with your homework or hard to deal with relationships, but you will pass that. Here is a lot of friends will help you to go through that, so don't worry about that. Time will adjust everything. After you stay here for a while, you probably adjust to it. So I wouldn't worry too much. Maybe right now, just get your language ready and、uh, get your heart ready, get your mind ready, prepare for American college life.